Hello YouTube friends and welcome. Today I would like to show you another uh, Firebird or as it was known before uh, Genzo or made by Genzo. I have changed the brand a little bit. Made by Genzo, designed by Firebird. Okay, I don't really know what's going on there. Some informations are changing on the packaging right now so we will see what the future will bring but today we will talk about the f7 491 and bk stands for black uh, you can get this knife also in orange and also in green g10 standard uh, ganzo packaging with nice pouch for transportation or storage or maybe a sunglasses, bubble wrap of course, so the knife is nicely and protected. And we have here the the knife itself. So, in my opinion, a really nice compact design. Um, I really don't know. Uh, who is the designer if it is some in-house design work or maybe they got some cues from another maker or maybe production company so if you if you know uh, the design uh, please uh, let me and my viewers know just keep putting uh, the information in the in the comments down below so thanks for that and let's talk about the knife so we have a bolster construction and this is a this is a liner lock slash uh, bolster lock or partial uh, framework why it is so as you can see the scale is all uh, is also functioning as the the stop uh, guard protection or over travel protection as you can see right here so as you can see this will we will won't classify also as a, as a liner lock but in my opinion uh, this uh, this uh, design is called uh, bolster lock because you cannot overextend the frame lock or the liner lock more than the uh, the scale and well, let's see what we have uh, inside the knife because I did uh, disassemble it for cleaning and oiling purposes okay and yes I need to mention that if you want to disassemble it, you need to take down the, the scale and you will find two uh, Torx screws and then sorry for that then you need to uh, overcome the the glue or, or the thread lock because it is uh, glued down and also the screws sorry I'll try to show you here so also the screws are thread locked with white thread lock glue and we have uh, cage bearings and also nice uh, nice blued hardware as you can see screws are nicely blued okay so the blade steel well known from uh, Genzo is 440c which is really decent steel for the price point we have a uh, close length of 12 centimeters 
or 4.72 inches. Uh, the blade length is 8.7 centimeters or 3.4 inches. The overall length is 20.7 centimeters or 8.15 inches. The blade width is 2.8 centimeters or 1.1 inch and the thickness is 3 millimeters or 0 0.12 uh, inches. The weight of the knife is 144 grams or 5.1 ounce. We have a nice uh, deep carry pocket clip. This is always good to see. I love when they are putting it on the knives. And it it's deep up and deep down, deep the down uh, only. So no attachment points on the other side. The scale is G10. You have three color variations, so green, uh, orange, and black. You have partially milling um, to give uh, uh, give the scale a little bit more traction. That is a fairly medium uh, grain uh, G10, so it will not shred up your pocket, and would be. Really nice for EDC carry, just for all your day, uh, daily needs. Maybe opening some packages and cutting some some mail and materials, of course. You have a nice jimping on the top. It. Uh, will sit really good in the hand a little bit of hotspot of course because of the pocket clip is there but overall really nice uh, design price wise you are looking to to pay around around 19 to 20 dollars i will i will also put all the informations and link to the uh, site where I purchase it and um, check it out because uh, Gearbest has always some flash sales on Genzo, so you will you will find uh, really good uh, good prices there. So if you have any questions. Please leave comments down below and as always have a nice day, bye.